Hi everyone, welcome back to Let's Pete Pikmin 3, Day 13. It's time to wrap up business in the Twilight River. It's going to be an exciting day. We're finally going to get to see Olimar and get on top of this big crazy stump that we've been seeing looming over us in the background this whole time. Now because I have some small idea of what might await us on top of that stump, I'm going to grab 60 pink Pikmin. Ah. Now why would anyone do that? I just love the guys. They're so much fun. They fly and they're super cute. Yeah. Pink Pikmin are the best. Alright, let's head to this stump. Okay, you know, we've got some nice uh, nine Pikmin sprays there, so I'm not going to worry about harvesting any more of that at the moment. Now, let's see, did we get this bridge done? We sure did. Let's head right up there. Oh man, it's rainy too. It must be... It must just smell like fall in this place, you know? One of the best smells there is. Maybe after this we can get the pink Pikmin a nice pumpkin spice latte. I'm a big fan, I will admit. There he is! There's Olimar. Oh. And... Bees? Oh boy. Wow, he's gone. Okay. Well, that's the end of the game. Oh my god! The biggest honeycomb you've ever seen? It's serenading us with music. What is it? Seriously, what is it? It's like a harpsichord bee? I don't know. It's freaking me out. Let's throw Charlie at it! No, that's not gonna help anything. <laughs> so if I throw a Pikmin at it... Oh, I guess he can attack him just fine. He's doing okay. Oh. No, he's getting protected by his little cronies. Well, this is bad. Uh oh, he's assembling him into spear formation here. But as they're, as they're attacking from the front, we attack from the back. Get him, everybody! Alright, nice. We took a little bit of a chip out of his health there. Can we go again? Can you just stay on him? Oh, yeah, he's down. Oh, he's just getting brutalized. This is great. Alright, looks like the little homies are back. I'm gonna grab some, uh, some Pikmin steroids here. Get these guys revved up. Yeah, it would tell you more about this guy if you haven't already gotten these data pads like I did. Charlie, get him! Okay, what are we doing? Spear formation again? Now you know this doesn't work. Come on, guy. Oh my god, it is working. He took a decent amount of my Pikmin away. Get revenge, guys! Oh yeah, look at that. He's got the other guys, so what I gotta do is I gotta, like, throw some Pikmin here and try to get him to set our little friends free. I guess they're doing that by, uh... Killing off his little bees, too, so that's kind of a win win. Better watch out for that. Let's get some more spray here. Alright, now he's got him in choir formation. Oh my gosh! Just wave after wave of his own men! How could you? My Pikmin are much smarter, and they have much better formations than you. You know, it's being a little unfair. It's not letting me uh, beat him up as much as I am. It's kind of giving him, you know, he gets up off the ground after he's got a little bit of uh, health taken away and prolongs this fight, but that's okay. It is a pretty cool fight. Uh-oh. Well, now this is horrible. Now he's just got me straight up surrounded. I guess if we, if we can beat him up while this circle closes in on me, that's helpful. weirdest little formations. Come on, let's see if we can just finish him off right now. He's so close. Yes! Alright. Goodbye, Honeycrisp. Oh no, and without his guidance, his troops are also lost. And there's Olimar. He's not moving. 
Those bees were just doing a weekend at Bernie's with his body. He's been dead this whole time. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh man, boy, there sure is a lot to do here. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and take the bee back. And let's go ahead and take Olimar. And let's go ahead and take this fruit. And let's really uh, send some reinforcements out here to help with that fruit. But, uh, you know, the other interesting thing is we can take back the bodies of his fallen comrades. And if I'm anything in Pikmin, I'm thorough. So I definitely want to do that. Uh, so what I'm going to try to do is bring back what we've already got and then come back here and continue picking up the rest of these guys. So let's go do that. Let's go follow on this... Uh, this... Brigade of Death. <laughs> Wait, Brigade? Does that make sense? March of Death, I don't know. It's kind of late here, so full disclosure. Alright, we've got everybody important that we need, so... Fair enough. And I think we've cleared out all the spiders along the way, so it should be a straightforward trek for these guys here. Yeah, so you know, I wonder what else, if there's anything else I should be doing in this place. I kind of think there's not. So, uh, you know what, I'm going to actually take a different way and we'll meet them back at the ship here. I think we've been actually pretty darn thorough the last couple of days, so there's not a bunch more to do. I really do just want to get the rest of those bees, though, and that'll up our numbers of pink Pikmin quite a lot. And we can be on our way off of this, uh, off of this autumn tundra here. Hmm. This thing, boy, what is this guy? You see him? It's like a little, uh, a little musical crab or something. Hmm. Maybe we can take him out. Maybe that can be our goal for today. Let's just whip his ass. Yeah, you stay out of there. You stay away from the ship. You you keep it over here. Hey, where are you going? Hmm, I really don't like his attitude. He thinks he owns the place, you know? Alright, here we go. The crew's back. Alright, let's just have everybody drop their stuff off and regroup here for a minute. <laughs> the Drake is analyzing Olimar. <laughs> and calling us with a report. Let's see what they've got to say. Analyzing Ol <laughs> recovered Olimar. He looks kind of ridiculous, frankly. He's a Hoctation, that's good. He's in stasis. His spacesuit has put him into sleep mode. Yeah, he's just sleeping, that's all it is. Wait, does he possess the cosmic drive key? Sweet! Good, okay, so we can question him after his stasis wears off. Good plan. Oh, I can't see what, can't wait to see what kind of methods we use to question this guy. Brutal torture, I'm sure. Alright, looks like we've got a few Pikmin to pluck here. Hey, it looks like they dropped a couple of bees here. What's going on here? Look at this. Oh, well, they shouldn't be here. I can't even target them. That's very strange. Okay, now where's that guy who was, uh... Freaky crab, where'd he go? Did he burrow over here? Alright, he's long gone. I don't care. Okay. Oh, the day's almost half over. Let's go and retrieve the rest of those bees. The day might be half over right now. Maybe that's what that bell means. You know, I'll put a couple of these guys on berry duty. I'm sure we've got enough. I guess just for fun, if you wanted, you could toss somebody down there and get the data pad. Oh, she's got it. Good job, Brittany. Alright, Brittany. Regroup back up there. <laughs> Sorry. Oops. <laughs> okay. She's lost. Looks like a dead end here. Alright, you're fine. You can figure it out from there. I'm glad you can just send them and, you know, they'll, they'll navigate around pretty darn well, these intrepid explorers here. Alright, let's get the cleanup duty going. You know, I wonder if I have enough guys. This is kind of crazy. This is a lot of bees. If you came upon this many dead bees in real life, boy, I'd have a lot of questions, you know? It's kind of messed up. 
Yeah, you know, boy, I just don't think we do have enough guys. The sheer number of these enemies is just unbelievable. Alright, they gotta go single file, you know, it's, it's the only way to really proceed here, so... Alright, we can get seven more. Okay, well, I don't know if we're going to be able to come and get every single one, but uh, that should be enough for a while. So I'm going to navigate our captains back to the ship here and have a nice drink of water. It's nice to have a day in this game where you don't have too much to do. Too many stressful activities to coordinate. So there's also challenges that come with this game, there's a numerous amount of challenges, maybe probably 20-30 plus I guess. I am not going to be showing those off, believe it or not, I tried. I tried to play one while recording, and I'm not bad at them, I mean it's, you know, it takes a little bit of practice, but uh, I was able to get the platinum medals on all of them, but uh, it is really hard to find stuff to talk about while you play that and also focus because it requires a ton of focus to just not screw up the day. Uh, so I learned that I cannot let's beat those. <laughs> Even though I think it would be cool. But maybe I can at least show off the times or something I have or I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll see how we're doing after we've done a few more of these and done the actual main story. So. You know, while I'm waiting for the rest of those guys to come back, let's grab some of these flowers here. That's at least something we can do. Oh nice, we're bringing back some berries, very good. You know what? I'm gonna do something crazy. I'm just gonna run back to that stump real quick. Oh boy, I don't know. Could we get the rest of the bees? You know I want to. Oh, I'm gonna regret this, aren't I? Hey Pete, don't do it. You could just be at the ship and end the day right now. You totally don't need to do this. There's really no point to get those extra bees. Oh, this is a bad idea. We're gonna lose Pikmin, guaranteed. Oh my god, come on, we never leave a man behind. You guys can do it. Get every single bee. I want every one of them. Every bee that we defeated. Take him back. Reclaim them and make new Pikmin and make new life. Okay, okay. We're trying, we're doing it. Alright, let's get out of this horrible stump forever. <laughs> okay, back to the ship. I have a strong feeling that uh, we're gonna watch a line of Pikmin barely make it to the ship or not make it. We'll see how they do. I mean, maybe you just gotta have faith in your team, right? These are solid pink Pikmin. These are well-trained soldiers. I think maybe they can do it. I believe in them. They've never steered us wrong. You know, a lot of them have those purple flowers too, so they're actually doing pretty good. They're actually making a pretty good pace here. You guys really needn't worry about these berries anymore. That's who we're gonna lose, I tell you. We've almost got enough. I think each time they bring that berry back, my little meter below my juice goes up. And there we go, we just got to 8 juice, so that's cool. Oh, this is great! Look at this, here comes the line. We're doing pretty good. You guys, oh man, you're so exceeding my expectations here. You are the fastest Pikmin ever created. Are Pikmin plants or animals? Did we, just, did we talk about this? I don't know if they are. I don't know what they are. Alright, let's call everybody back. I don't even want to lose the, that berry team over there. I'm going to tuck these guys in. 
We got five out in the field still. Alright, come on you guys. I'm gonna keep sounding the Pikmin Clarion here. <laughs> it even kind of sounds like a Pikmin. Alright, can they make it back? Yes, I think they can. We got two. Oh, he's got a berry. Look at him go. See, now we're... Okay. Thank you. Who's left out there, I wonder? A couple more guys at the berry bush. Well, we'll see if they make it. They're so dedicated. See, I thought I said before that, like, calling them doesn't always seem like it brings them back. It seems like when they're on berry duty, they just, uh, get really focused and they don't want to give up their work, so... Here's another one. And the last one's up there on the berry still, so he's not going to make it back, but we did a pretty good job. I'll tell you what, he can just hang out there and, uh, you know, we will totally be back here, so maybe all is not lost. Alright, not bad. We got what we came for, which is Captain Olimar. Let's get the heck out of this place now. Blast off into the safety of orbit. Oh, here he comes. Guys? <laughs> um, I found the coolest berry. Oh, boy. Okay, well, he will be missed. His little ghost, I think, had little wings, too. Is that something that just the pink ones have? Okay, that's funny. Alright, we're back up in the depths of space here. Oh, yeah, that's right. This was inside that crazy bee creature. Seed hive. What is this supposed to be? I'm not sure what this is. Is it a... It's not a pear, is it? Hmm. I don't know. Pears don't really look like that as far as I can tell. Gotta be honest, in real life I'm not a big fruit guy. A lot of fruits are a little too sweet for me. I do like a pear, though. Plenty of juice. Alright, cool. Well... Well, it doesn't really matter. We're all done. We got Olimar, and he's got the Cosmic Drive Key, so we should be done, right? Wrapping up the game. Hmm. Yeah, we got him. Oh, yeah, he's in stasis. That's right. All right. Let's relax and get some rest. Not the best day, really. I thought it was a pretty decent day. We uh, fought a cool boss, and... Got all his little bee buddies back in the ship, which I just love doing. Alright, so I suppose we're going to have to wait to find out what's going on with Captain Olimar until next time, day 14, on Let's Pete Pikmin 3. See you then.